maybe if you had the opportunity to let the nail grow a little longer, you know, you would get a, a little brighter sound. It's, the sound is not bad, it's good. If, of course, that part there when you have to move your finger, let's say, on the seventh fret, uh, that you do. When you, when you go here, sometimes it's difficult to, to land on the right, obviously, it requires a lot of work. So, sometimes I can hear maybe a little bit of pulling the string a little bit down. So you have to make sure that when you land in there, the, the bar and the finger hold the string very in place. That way it doesn't distort the sound, like that. sections once right you repeat the first section repeat the second section but the first time that you do the first section maybe don't do so much the slow down not so uh, you know yeah, slow but not that much that way it doesn't give it a sense of any that you have to switch so it's got to be like this second part, since we're not repeating the second part, let's say you're doing the ending here, you're going, let me see the ending, that you're going, you know, so it's everything within the speed that you're choosing, let's do it together, the whole piece, ready? some dynamics it's a little bit more difficult because you know we're more concerned about the technical aspect but the, this song has a very strong melody you can tell exactly where the phrases end and and uh, and start again so you can sort of close a phrase and start another phrase like this So it has that wavy sound. So let's try one more time. Let's see if we can do the dynamics. At least <laughs> it's a, the intention is there. <laughs> you just play the way you, you play it and tell the word to slow down maybe a little bit. 